All right, what up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Just out here at Lake Cat Eye. Uh, just gonna be throwing some um, divers down, dive with double clutches and stuff like that. Um, yeah, it's pretty dry down here though. Look at look at all the look at all the sand flats. There's not much water in here, but there's plenty of fish, I think. As you can see, oh, you can see a fair few um, fish on the surface, mullet and stuff like that, I'd say. And the other day, uh, yesterday we were actually down here with my daughter, and um, we dropped a good flathead, probably in the high 80s, uh, high 70s. Um, it just didn't keep it tight, so we dropped it. I wanted to say, what, what does everyone reckon um, the council or whoever is in charge of the lake should should um, do? Like. It's obviously not working what they're doing now. Should they open it? Um, yeah, just being down here now, it's pretty yeah, it's pretty dry, like as you can see. What does everyone reckon needs to be done? Does it need to be opened? Do they need to put a break wall in? Um, do they need to leave it? I don't know. To be honest, I'm not an expert, but I'll just, yeah, maybe everyone that knows what they reckon should do, just put it down below in the comments um, and let us know. It'd be interesting to see what everyone reckons. I reckon they need to put a, like, a break wall in on the... On the northern end but um yeah i don't know i'm no expert anyway let's get into the fishing yeah yeah we'll throw this big fella out see what we can come up with all right let's go we've got dial with double clutch on in the gold we'll just start throwing it out and see what we can come up with There's plenty of fish still in here and plenty of bait, so this is not much water, that's the thing. The old die with double clutch should get some bites, hopefully. As I was saying before, I um, dropped a pretty decent one before. Yesterday, I was just down here playing with the daughter. Would have been high 70s. Just shake the lure. Not enough pressure. Anyway, hopefully we can find it again today. Big long cast. And just wind it back. Hoping for a good hit. Double clutch has proven to be a great lure previously, so oh yes. <laughs> the hell? What do we got? Def definitely foul hooked. Guessing it's just a flathead. He's swimming this way. There we go, tiny flathead. Hooked in the gut there. That dial a double clutch. Not a bad little fish, finally got a little one. See what else we can get. It's a little flatty. We're after something a bit bigger though. So let's keep going. Comment down below if you think there's any sharks in here. It'd have to be, wouldn't it? Always check your leader. For any dings or there's plenty of flooded those. Oh yep. Yeah. Got one. It's another foul hooked. Little fella. <laughs> Tiny, Are you kidding? He's just gonna go nuts.
All right, second, only tiny though. Not where we're after. We're after a lot bigger. Yep. It's only little, I think. It's not bad. Another fouled up little fella. Fouled up again. <laughs> Got the dialogue double clutch off. Good looking fish. Not a bad size. Oh. <laughs> That's three. Oh, <laughs> Not a little fella. There's four on the die of a double clutch in about an hour and a half. It wouldn't even be an hour actually. That's four on um, the Daiwa double clutch. Four in um, about 45 to an hour's worth of minutes. Let's see if there's anything out this way. It's pretty shallow. <laughs> There's a hole. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna go knees and nuts. That's a good one. That's a bit better than the rest. Well, that's probably the best one I've got yet. Here's another one. Two just take out, took off. Another one. Let's <laughs> get him over here. All right. After he's gone nuts. Get this one out, hopefully. Let him go. Come on, bud. All right, there we go. 
there. Oh, that's the best yet. And coming up from over here, there's so many sitting on this little sand flat. Yep. Oh, oh, this is a good one. This is a good one. Uh, he's not that much better, really. Just foul hooked him again, and I look flattered. <laughs> Flatty, a good one for the release. That's the sixth. All right, so that's the sixth in about an hour. Oh, <laughs> right there. <laughs> what? You must have followed that. Swimming this way. <laughs> what a good fish. This is a good one, I think. It's not massive, but... Definitely a good fish. Yeah, just fouled a hook. He's <laughs> right at my feet. No, oh, he's a good fish. Oh. All right. All right, there we go. Not a bad fish for Lake Cateye. Caught him on the dial with double clutch. Um, yeah, well, I've proven that there's plenty of fish here. Got about uh, six in um, what says an hour and 19 minutes. Um, once I got around the bend, I got a few more. Um, anyway, that's a nice fish. Anyway, let's get him back in the water and um, yeah, I'll end the video here, I think. I'll just, I may keep fishing. Oh. Get the hooks out. Go for the release. Not a bad fish. Alright. Let's go for the release. Let him go. 
course. Always sprays you. Our lure of choice is Daiwa double clutch with the three hooks. Can't remember what size it is or colour. It definitely did the job. Yeah, I got six flathead, as I said, in I think it was an hour and 19 minutes. Some people would say that's pretty bad, but not for a lake like this, I'd say. There's not much water left. Anyway, hopefully they do something about it fairly soon. It's pretty sad. Yep. Good fish, I think. Yeah, I mean, it's just a normal average size we've been getting. Uh, another one. Got me again. <laughs> right there. <laughs> there we go, them. That's good. That's good. We're gonna have to have a spine in my finger. <laughs> right there. <laughs> what? <laughs> Again. You just hooked that one. Got him off, yes. Yep. There <laughs> we go. It's about the tenth. Two hours. All right, that'll probably do it for this afternoon. Um, out here on Lake Carter, I ended up with probably, oh, I'd say at least 12 fish in about two, two hours, two and a half hours. Um, yeah, so if has any ideas of what they reckon should happen down here at Lake Carter, uh, comment down below. It'll be interesting to see what everyone thinks. Um, I reckon, yeah, they should put a break wall in, but I don't know. That'd be pretty cool if they did. Um, yeah, the tackle I was using, just a... Just a light setup. I think it's just 10 pound leader, 10 pound line, and a dial with double clutch, um, and just a Nachi two and a half size spinning reel. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, see you in the next video. Yeah.